So I'm here to talk about open source design and a project that I've been working on called Open Design. So this is about how to engage with designers on open source. So I'm a designer, I work at Ushahidi. We create humanitarian open source tech tools. And I'm very new to open source. Like my first experience of it was through Ushahidi. And I was like, okay, this is really cool. But how do designers become more aware of open source? And how do you start getting more design contributions to open source tools? How do you do all of the different kinds of complicated advocacy work within open source to understand the value of what design can offer these tools? And likewise, how do you kind of break into the design industry, which largely doesn't get told about these tools, to get them to contribute? And no, let them know that they are there, that, that they are able to contribute to these tools. So why aren't there many design-related contributions to open source software? So what we found out through starting a project at Ushahidi called Open Design was that designers are really ready to contribute to things that do good. And the thing that they could understand relatively easily was the kinds of tools that Ushahidi created, which were humanitarian open source tech tools. So we started at that from a basis. So we used the introduction of humanitarian to help them introduce, be introduced to open source. So we started by doing challenge gatherings, so kind of like your typical hackathon or design jam approach. And we did one in Berlin in 2018 around one of Ushahidi's tools 10.4, which is now open source and one in Seattle in 2019. What we found was that when you have a design group get together around issues that might be needed within your repos, unless you're really well defining your issues, designers tend to go off on like these kinds of design fiction tangents. So they'll start creating different things that might solve problems for your tools in the future, but maybe not solving problems for the issues that you have in your repos right now. Now this can be really, really useful for your open source projects much in the future, but if you're looking for active contributions right now to things that you know that you need, it's not really gonna help right now. So this is one of the things that we learned from the, these first two events that we did and we've subsequently started to plan events for this year we've got one coming up in Bangalore and one coming up in Nairobi that are much more around structuring clear issues and clear needs but from designers for the open source softwares so again going back to the question of why aren't there many design contributions to open source so there's actually many, many more reasons than I have time for but the main one Designers don't really have a clue about open source. Like I said myself at the beginning, my first introduction to it was with Ushahidi. So one of the main things that's a challenge here is getting more designers to know about open source. And what you can do there is go to design conferences. Like a designer here at open source conferences, you can cross-pollinate. You can go to these places and talk about these tools. Even if designers know about open source, GitHub can be a barrier. Sometimes it can be actively scary for designers. So helping them understand how they can interact with things like GitHub or where you host your project is really, really useful. Suggestions on engaging designers may be your first issues in your repos. There's some really great things that if you're not quite sure how to ask for design contributions to begin with, I really recommend the two links on the screen here. One is from Brad Frost, the interface inventory, really useful for any project. And heuristics, so asking designers to produce design heuristics for your projects, it's really, really useful. Take a look at these links, create issues for these in your open source repos. You'll get a wealth of information. Some suggestions on structuring repo issues for designers, if you're ready to add them. Make a tag for designers, make a label for designers, very clear, very, very obvious. But also maybe split these into different design asks. So you might have one for graphics, for icons, for UX or UI. Give as much information as possible in your issues, like give the background information about your users as much as you can. Design documentation, super useful. Ushahidi's just pr produced a load of design documentation that you can use. And learn how to critique design. Finally, follow the Open Design Project. Get involved if you have an open source project you want represented. Thanks.